Barry and Joy Lambert visited Denmark to tell us about the remarkable improvement in their granddaughter's rare illness after taking Indoka CBD oil. So how, how did you become involved in hemp? Well, we became involved in hemp because our granddaughter's got uh, an epilepsy condition called Dravet syndrome. Uh -huh. And our son researched the place and come across uh, your product, Indoka. Uh -huh. Caitlin had a two and a half hour seizure and had to be helicoptered to a specialist hospital and we decided that if we could improve her situation, then we would do that. Who do you love more than your children? Your grandchildren. So you feel like the hemp plant has changed your life? Well, uh, not our life as such, but our granddaughter's life it has. Um, the, 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 the product she's taking um, has worked wonders for her. I think over time we'll be proven to have other medicinal benefits to other people with other, other conditions, not just epilepsy. I've seen such a difference in, in Caitlin since she's been on the CBD. She's happier, she's more alert. Um, she goes to preschool. We don't feel as though she's going to go to preschool and have six seizures through that day or a seizure that takes her to hospital. So we're very happy with that. It's a little step, but we've got to be thankful for little steps. She's alive. And it didn't take long for one of the specialists to say to him, Caitlin looks good today. I don't know what you're doing, but whatever you're doing, keep going. And Michael was encouraged by that, and he was thankful that someone said that to him. Because you're supposedly doing the wrong thing, and you don't feel in your heart you are. I took some. Um, then all of a sudden I, I noticed when I was getting out of bed of the morning, it was, uh, I wasn't getting out of bed like an old man that I used to, that uh, my arthritis had disappeared. One night he sat down with three scientists from Sydney University and met these three people who came to our house eventually and sat around our dining table and we had lunch. Michael felt we could give some money to uh, help with a trial at Sydney University and that's what we did. Well, I think it's all about education and research. Uh, doctors are very much scientifically driven and, and um, so they need the research, they need evidence. Uh, scientific evidence it's got to be approved by the various medical bodies, etc. So that's the reason why we're uh, supporting the, the formal legal uh, scientific research for Sydney University, uh, and hopefully they'll prove it that what companies like Indoka know and believe to be true. Hopefully the, the scientists will prove that beyond doubt. I think that the cannabis plant will be proven to be the wonder plant uh, of, of this century. Uh, I know it's been around for. <laughs> Previous centuries Thousands too. of years. Previous centuries, but um, I think scientists will discover what a wonderful planet is and um, it, it'll be a great benefit to, to mankind. Mm -hmm.